Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we are here with an early reaction to The Last of Us because this episode is releasing today instead of Monday or Sunday for American viewers, but it's technically Monday for the UK. Um, so this is releasing today because the Super Bowl is on Sunday. So they decided to give us the episode early, which I am very excited about, uh, but also really nervous because um, just, I just... I'm just nervous. I just, I just am. Um, I'm excited to see where we go with, uh, like, I'm excited to see Henry and Sam. I am excited to see what they do with the characters and how they go about things and what they're going to be like. Um, so let's get into episode five. I don't think I'm ever going to get over this intro. Like, it's been in my head constantly since the beginning of the season. Like, it's just in my head constantly. Fuck you, Fedra. I'm done. Damn, I mean, this is pretty brutal. They are shitty people, but it's brutal. Fuck. Is Sam deaf? Or was he just, does he just know sign and is just trying to be really quiet? There he is. There's the Dilf. I mean, what? How long do you think we should wait? Should we wait a day or two? Should I hope that is a bloater that's under the floor and it kills her. Let's give him a Christ. Oh, it's him. Is that the doctor? Why, why is this making me emotional, bro? <laughs> We're only like five minutes in. <laughs> so many crayons. Oh, he's so happy. Stop, I'm going to cry. That's so fucking wholesome. It's so nice because Game Henry didn't really let Sam do stuff. Like he picked up a toy and he's like, no, put it down. You don't need it. But here he's letting him, like, just do his thing. That's so cute. This is so hard for a kid to have to deal with, man. It's hard enough for adults, but for kids... Especially one who hasn't experienced a normal life before a fucking apocalypse. This is so cute. You're a superhero now. Super Sam. I want to hug him. I want to hug them both. Oh god, that must be really scary not being able to hear all that as well. Not knowing what's happening. That's... Oh, it's Joel! He's like, huh? Friend? Ally? Potential? Oh, Joel looked directly at him. Oh. 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 New plan. Find the hot dude. <laughs> Eyes on me. What about what He's like, why is there a child pointing a gun at me? I don't want to hurt you. It's a weird fucking tone, man. That's just the way he sounds. He has an asshole voice. Joe, <laughs> Dude. Fuck. Okay. Listen. Joe, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Never killed anyone. And pointing an unloaded gun at you is the closest I've ever come to being violent. An unloaded gun. Damn. So that's the deal. That was a risk. That was a risk. I mean, they did say before they didn't have ammo, but it didn't click with me that he was pointing it unarmed. Oh, that's... Oh, stop! That's so cute! I in a long time. Oh! So how are we getting out? His laugh! At the fucking pun book, of all things. <laughs> she should show him her comics of, like, the superheroes and stuff. They're going to help 
us escape. Right? I mean, you've already told the child that, so you got... <laughs> I love... <laughs> Joel's facial expressions are perfect. Pedro has done this so fucking perfectly. I, I, I think it's this way. Not very confident when he says, Oh, I, I think it's this way. I literally played the level with these guys on stream today. So I'm just like... <laughs> oh, Ellie's holding on to Sam. It's so cute. It is that. Damn. Damn. It is just like they have it in the game. All the kids toys, everything, the stuff on the notebook, the goal with probably the football. What happened to them? Maybe they didn't follow the rules and they all got Pretty sure those are the same rules we see in the game too. Ish. Oh my god, ish. <laughs> I love their friendship so much. The edge of the universe. And back. Endure. And survive. Endure and survive. Dude, stop. Survive. Endure. Survive. Fuck yeah, man. <laughs> now keep it down. We're not out yet. Ah, they did the football thing as well. Come on, watch your back. <laughs> Sam, he, uh, he got sick. Leukemia. Yeah. Anyway, um, there was one drug that worked. And, whoa, big shock. There wasn't much left of it. Yeah. So, still think they should take it easy on me? I mean, you had a valid point. I don't know what you're waiting on, man. I am the bad guy because I did a bad guy thing. But no. He would do the exact same father. thing. But you were someone's. So I could tell. Oh, I really like Henry in this. I really like him. You know, I'm not buying the sob, the sob story. I get she's lost, you know, her brother, but she also... I get why she's hunting Henry, but... The fact she's hiding a bloater under the floor, well, a potential bloater that I think is a bloater. She's hiding something under that floor. And she just shot a doctor for no reason, killing people for no reason. Oh man, are we gonna have the sniper? Is that gonna be a thing? Like, no, Ellie, never, ever, ever happened. <laughs> and then I'm like, I'm gonna ask you a million more times, and he's like, Look! Oh! Go! The fuck is that coming from? Fuck. It is the sniper. Shit. This is like my most hated part of the game. Go. You stay here, Joel's gonna go flank them. Stay here. Get in the house through the back, and then I'll take him out. But if you go out there, he's gonna kill you. It's dark, and he has shit aim. Nobody's gonna kill me. But he's gonna kill us. <laughs> and he has shit aim. Keep your head down, Ellie. Uh, hello. Please don't do it. Please. Please. I mean, fair. I didn't expect him to get to that house that quickly. I expected there to be more people around. Oh, the tank. The fucking tank. And then they're gonna attract the clickers and the zombies. Fuck. Oh, good god. Ellie! 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 Oh my god! 
that is a child you're about to run over. I mean, if that's not going to attract the runners and the clickers and all the infected, then I don't know what is. Just let the kids go. No. Sorry. Oh, you bitch. The girl was with the man who killed Brian. But did you ever stop to think that maybe he was supposed to die? He's just a fucking kid. What a bitch. Die, Henry. Whoa. Die all the time. Oh, Joel did not like that. That fucking sinkhole? And there they are. Okay, that's a little bit more than I expected. Oh no! Oh no! Big boy bloater! Ho! Ho! He's gonna die to the bloater, isn't he? I'm gonna be so upset. Perry, no! Perry, no! Oh, don't give up your life for her! No! No! He just ripped his head apart! Oh my god, Joel is shake. Uh, Ellie, 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 Joel, Joel, Joel. That is a child. That is a fucking child clicker. What the fuck? Yeah, please keep that trapped in the thing. Do not kill it. Holy shit! Yes! Knife! Let's go! It's happened, hasn't it? It fucking... It's happened. That's where it happened. Oh, come on, Kathleen! Jesus fucking Christ! Are you for real? Look how many fucking zombies there is! <laughs> That's what you get for talking shit about kids, bitch. That is... Oh, God, the cut to silence. That's fucking horrifying. Good God, that was insane. No. I'm gonna wake up to Ellie screaming. I just know it. I'm scared of ending up alone. Damn. Is he gonna ask the question? Is it still you inside? He did ask the fucking question! Give him the reassurance. Damn, she told him. I don't think this is how it works, Ellie. At least she's trying. That's so, that's so, like, sweet of her. That she didn't just scream for help. She just tried her best to help him. Stay awake with me. Oh. Oh, stop. <laughs> he 
even though I knew it was gonna happen, it's still so fucking horrible seeing it as people. Like, they're not just like cartoons in a video game. Fuck. Oh god, the fucking raw emotion from him, Jesus Christ. My eyes are stinging, I can't see anything. It says I'm sorry! <laughs> you know, this music is not helping my emotions right now. <laughs> I don't even know where to begin, or how to begin, or if I can even speak because I'm so emotional. <laughs> That was absolutely horrible. Like I said, knowing that that was going to happen. Well, obviously not knowing in case maybe they changed, you know, they changed the game a little bit. But, no, nope, it happened exactly the way it did. Fucking hell. It, it It's so much ho more horrible seeing how sweet Sam was and just him and all the shit that he's gone through as well. And him still just being a, a positive, as happy as can be. And, you know, laughing with Ellie and getting to draw and play with toys and play football. And, you know, Henry getting to hear him laugh again. And then you just see him, a child, get shot. And then, the like I said, the raw emotion that came from Henry when he realized what he did. Good God. Good fucking God. <sighs> And for Ellie, of all people, to have to witness this, Joel has had to witness things like this for so long now. Um, uh, as we saw in like the first episode or second episode, I think, um, with him, you know, like getting rid of bodies and all that kind of stuff with Tess, and it was like he's used to seeing this stuff. Obviously, it's different when it's a child, and obviously, hearing what Kathleen had to say obviously didn't help. But I am so glad that she died from a child flicker because of the way she talks shit about kids like she is like the most horrible fucking person like i knew that she was horrible but i didn't realize she was gonna go that far and as much as i was hoping she was gonna get killed by the bloater i think she deserved this way more but speaking of that fucking bloater that was fucking terrifying i wasn't sure if we were gonna get a bloater but after what was under those floorboards, and she was like, oh, let's not tell anyone. You gotta fucking told people. Perry wouldn't be dead, probably. I mean, he probably would be, because there was a shit ton of fucking infected there. But I'm so upset that Perry got his head ripped off. He was wonderful. He was so hot, and he was just... I just liked him, but also, I also didn't like the fact that he was like, uh, uh, I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna stick up for Kathleen. I'm gonna lick her ass. Like, you know, it, it is what it is. You, you gotta adapt and you know whatever but ugh, fuck the bloater was terrifying i i kind of hope we get to see more of the bloater um because you know we missed out on a, on a couple of scenes with the bloater uh beforehand but i am glad that we did get to see him and they've done fucking great with how he looks and the way he runs and he's terrifying and he's so heavy and the way he just slams people Good God, he is terrifying. Uh, the amount of zombies, or sorry, infected, I know they're not zombies. The amount of infected that came out of that fucking hole, I was not expecting it. Like, you see them in the game where they kind of run in from all directions. And there's a lot of them, but not a huge fucking pile up of like hundreds of them just coming out of a fucking sinkhole. That was unexpected as fuck. Um, but yeah, the it was it was just such a good episode. It was so beautifully done, and... You know, it was obviously very fast paced, but that's just how this show is. It is going quite fast, and I am sad that we had to say goodbye to Sam and Henry. I, and like I said, I literally played, I didn't get to this part. I just got to the part with the sniper, and then I had to end stream. But I was replaying The Last of Us till I on stream, and I got to Sam and Henry, and I was like, no, I. <laughs> And I was like, this is bad timing. This is such bad timing. So I'm like going through so many extra emotions right now. Um, but yeah, that was a very good episode. And I think now this is going to also strengthen Joel and Ellie's bond. Um, 
And Pedro was wonderful this episode again. His facial emotions, like his, the way he speaks, the way he puts himself across, he's just perfect. He really, really is such a good Joel, and he, he convinces me that he just is Joel. Um, and it's the exact same with Bella. They completely, completely convince me that they're made to be Ellie. Like they, they both just, both of them just fit the roles perfectly, and I'm so happy. Um, so next week, I'm going to take a guess that we're going to find Tommy, maybe with the sort of pacing of the show. I think maybe this is where we lead into seeing Tommy. Uh, I'm not sure. I can't remember the exact timeline of the game. It has been a while since I've properly played it. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing next week's episode. Next week, we're going to have to wait a little bit longer because obviously we're going from Friday till not this Monday, but next Monday. So we're going to have to wait like an extra couple of days but you know it'll be it'll be fine i we need time to recover after this episode like i thought episode three was bad and then they add this on last week i didn't cry but this week oh my god they're just absolutely killing it with every single episode i haven't been disappointed at all not at all um and i just i'm just gobsmacked by how good this fucking show is man um but yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching i hope you are all okay i hope your emotions aren't destroying you right now um but also if you needed a cry i hope you got a good cry out of it because i certainly did it fucking hurt my eyes half my makeup is off but yeah thank you guys for watching make sure you subscribe for more the last of us content and a bunch of star wars content um and i will see you guys on my next video so peace and always remember, endure and survive. <laughs>